I had no real plan. I was going to give the kidnapper all the manuscript pages I had for Alice. If that wasn't enough, I'd hold him at gunpoint and make him talk. dark presence was moving ahead of me in the same direction I was going. A cold feeling settled itself in the pit of my stomach. Was it going for Alice? The graveyard shift may cause cancer.
The place was dead, a ghost town. Had been for decades, maybe a century. I lifted the page in front of my eyes and read it. In it, I lifted the page in front of my eyes and read it. In it, I lifted the page in front of my eyes and read it. In it, I lifted the page in front of my eyes and read it. In it, I lifted the page in front of my eyes and read it. In it, I lifted the page in front of my eyes and read it. Doc sat down heavily. He examined Barry and Rose. Barry was already recovering. Rose was another story. She was conscious, but she was barely present, almost delirious, disturbed, touched in the head, they used to say. It wasn't the first time Doc had seen someone in such a state, but it had been over 30 years. Doc poured himself a stiff drink. He hadn't forgotten a thing. <laughs> 